Okay, so in our last update on the LMG Lounge slash Employee Happiness Center, we got this place pretty much ready to watch movies. 77 inch TV from Samsung, uh, 950 series, super high end sound bar from Samsung with surround. We've got the couches in now. These are freaking awesome. The only problem is that, what are the odds that you guys are gonna hang around at the end of the day and watch a movie together? With you? Not good. <laughs> yeah, not good. So, Today, because we are constantly tinkering with things, it's like a compulsion, we are getting this place gaming ready. And when I say gaming, I don't mean like some PC master race, blah, blah, blah. Oh no, Xbox for life, it's faster, it's, it's, it's easier, whatever. No, 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 everything, okay? PlayStation 4 Pro, Xbox One X, Nintendo Switch, PC, obviously, and we are changing out the TV. We're actually going down in size from 77 to 65 inches, but this right here is one of the first ones ugh, to go outside of ASUS headquarters. This is a BFGD, a big fucking gaming display. Excuse me, I mean big format gaming display. With Glassware, you can instantly see your current and past network activity, detect malware, and block badly behaving apps on your PC or Android device. Use offer code Linus to get 25% off Glassware at the link below. We got the checklist right here. The to do this is, ter this is terrible. This is great. No, I mean, energy. yeah, your, your energy is terrible. Small energy. Small energy. First thing we're gonna do, we're gonna cross that off. Yeah, we're, not doing we're gonna deal with the receiver later. So, actually, dbrand hooked us right up with a whole bunch of this console gaming stuff because let's face it were we going to spend our money on consoles okay there's a there's a touch of pcmr mentality around here we weren't going to do that so uh you do game consoles and james and i will do um grown men things and we will get the tv unpacked and mounted to the wall i hope you're not expecting a lot from me i only signed up for exactly what's happening right now yeah let's go james come on come on Whoa, Oh I, oh, I just heard the tape coming off the wall. I was like, this is a Velcro uh, okay. mount or what? Whoa! Mm, no, no. Okay, kinda. Should be fine. <laughs> um, maybe just over there against the wall. Uh, or it could be balanced on top of these boxes. What? Put that soft ass blanket down. And we can just put it on the floor. Yeah, just, no, no, just, yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. No, just, yeah. Yeah, yeah. just, no. Yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. no. No. Yeah. Oh. So what's so exciting about this thing for us is the fact that BFGDs are able to not only run at 4K, but they can do it at 120 hertz with G-Sync on a supported graphics card, and they have extremely low input lag. So if we were playing like, you know, Super Mario World, for example, is a game that is just almost impossible for me as a kid who grew up playing it on a CRT to play on a modern TV. Theoretically, this should be able to handle that just fine because it'll have nearly imperceptible input lag. I'm super excited about this. This thing is so girthy. Oh man. Oh, she's deep. Thick. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You can't pull oh, it away a, from me. It has a stand on it already. Oh. Now that is toolless setup. Other than you two, I guess. Wow. Awesome. Oh yeah, that's right. I didn't even mention that before. So we are going to put a VR setup into this little pseudo living room as well. So that was the reason that we put a plug up there so we can run our lighthouses without having to deal with any cable wiring mess. The stand on this TV is probably like half of the weight. Really? Oh my God. This is pretty dank. Yeah, I know. Doesn't it look sick? It looks floral, like you said. Looks dope. I had it on my V30 and looked awesome. Yeah? Mm. Ah. Yeah, that's moderately sturdy. I hate ladders. Beats the former. Wow, I just got that. I was like, what the fuck are you? What is the, what was the ladder? Oh! <laughs> Damn it. What do you reckon? I reckon I'll be all right. Mate. That is a very long screw for how heavy that thing is. We gotta make sure it's tight because once there's a bump and sub in here, we don't want it to vibrate away. Wait, what kind of sub did you get? 500 watt, 15 inch sub. Hell yeah. I never knew that the BFD would be so B. Yeah, it's really thick. It's a thick boy. Oh Lord, he coming. 
It might be a little high now for this. Uh, that's where it goes. Uh, oh, oh, yeah. uh, no, one more, one more. There, oh, hey, hey. Hey. So I totally forgot about this. What is that? We haven't torn down the world's fastest gaming machine yet. Oh, is that 2080 Ti's? This is two 2080 Ti's with a 9900K. It's This is literally as fast as it gets. Yeah, all right. And conveniently, because uh, Asus hooked us up with this monitor, it's not full of like MSI stuff. Oh, nice. So that worked out. This monitor. Wait, it does have an MSI motherboard, if I recall correctly. Yeah, it does. But Asus graphics card, so there you go. Am I, I'm totally in the way. Oh, you're probably going to need uh, this, your mom's favorite cable. DP. Wow. Don't put that in the video. Put that in the video. It's gonna go in the video now. It goes in everywhere no, it else. Doesn't go in the video. So one of the things that you need in order to run the Vive wirelessly is one of these puppies. So this uses 60 gigahertz wireless, which is the only wireless connection that's fast enough and low latency enough to handle like VR gaming without a wire. What was our plan for uh, all these HDMI devices? Well, the soundbar has HDMI switching, right? Yeah, it's got a couple inputs, but that's it, I think. All right, so we gotta use the receiver. Good thing we have a Harmony. Yeah, so this is like pretty much the best like money for performance 7.2 channel you can get. Cool. Just perfect for the 5.1.2 setup we'll be doing later. Nice. Oh, cable managing all this is gonna kinda suck. I'm just working on my 13th controller over here. Oh my god. I almost pulled a Linus. Oh my god, look at this. These almost look like the little like hi my name is name tags. Just write shit on there. Uh, do you mind moving back a little bit, that whole table? I need room for my ass. Your ass? Nothing about VR makes you look like not a nerd. How do I look? Um, like a nerd? Like a nerd. Like a big nerd. Like not not a nerd? Wow. Like Rudolph the like... R nerd nose. Mask wearing nerd. <laughs> so uh, what's going on? I straight up cannot figure out how to turn this display on because... It's the switch. Yeah, but like, then what? There's buttons on the bottom. Yeah, there. I see the buttons, but like they don't do anything. Did you plug everything in properly? Damn it. He had the HDMI plugged in, hey? Yeah, I put the wrong one. <laughs> okay, Republic of Gamers, let's hit it. Hey! Hey! All right! Oh, Meg. Oh, it's MSI's stupid. They think they're ROG, but it's... MSI Elite Gaming? I don't, I don't know, something like that. Meg. Okay, so I come bearing networking things. I figure we go hardline for everything, right? That's pretty nice. Hell yeah. Oh, uh, it's not gonna be long enough. That one is, that one's not gonna reach. I'm not gonna and... lie. It looks like the people over there were having way more fun than us. Hey, pay attention. When she moved, she went to Dennis, hit the drum or walk to a town, she can really get it, really. I think maybe it's not gonna ever fall off. I think I need a Linus Tech Tips cable tie. Hey! Oh, this feels very sturdy. Are you being sarcastic? It feels okay to me. No. Oh, okay. Do you find these tips helpful? No, I don't. Leave. I don't know how uh, this works. Tighten. Yeah, okay. There you go. Switch. Other switch. Other more different switch. Done. D-brand. Done. Thanks, D-brand. I think we need to like actually play Three. some video games. Yeah, good luck. All right, your device is ready to go. Boom! Oh, uh, these controllers suck. Uh, do we have an Xbox dongle in there? Oh wait, are you saying you get the Xbox one? Yeah. There are enough PlayStation controllers for everybody. He could use one. We all got one. But he Why would I Xbox. want one of those? Why would we? Why would we all? <laughs> I don't want one. Give me an Xbox one. I'm gonna go into Device Manager and disable the Xbox dongle. Can you not? Can, it's not even working. Is there gonna be any rules or regulations about? washing your hands before you use controllers, or are we just gonna have a disgusting mess of greasy controllers all the uh, time? We're probably gonna have a disgusting mess of greasy controllers. And I'll put some wet wipes over there. I'm never coming here. Whoa, I have a rocket launcher. I have a flamethrower, and a headbutt, and a bomb. <laughs> Are there even bad guys in this game? Yeah, like how is, is this supposed to be difficult, or is this just like one of those games where- No, it's just- You literally just run and shoot things, and they don't even try and shoot back? This I just killed the devil. Wow, you totally just sniped that. Do we well, die? Everyone's if... supposed to get on it. Do you die? Do we die if we don't get on? Uh, yeah. 
Now, this game sucks, Linus. Yeah, what the hell? You guys suck. <laughs> All right, I don't know how any of the characters work. We Fit Trainer, what? We Fit Trainer, really? What are you typing right now? Oh, your name? God's, God's dick. Oh God, what is this Japanese? <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> I don't know how this game works. Okay, what is going on? I'm doing my final smash, bro. You're not trying to smash, bro? Hey, yeah! Did we unlock somebody? Yeah! Do I have to fight this person? If you lose, I'll kill you. Is it only me? Oh, <laughs> oh my god. no! Oh no! <laughs> You're, You're so done! <laughs> oh, oh no! Oh! No! No! <laughs> oh, the controls! Oh god. The controls. The controls. Yeah, my Seriously! My controller guy! Buttons. No, no, it's not that. It's that I'm trying to do my up and B, but my up and B is not B. Oh, I got you. Here we go. I'm gonna be, uh, Bangalore again. Okay. Ew, why did you change it to 110 degree field of view? This isn't, uh, it's like all fish -y. I just I've it's... probably gone to like 100. All right, I'm gonna win. Oh, that doesn't, that looks like a network connection thing. It looks pretty dope though. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty cool. <laughs> oh, supply bin. Oh, there's enemies. You should put it in single fire mode. Yep, what was the button B. for that again? Are you sure? You're still in burst B. Oh, there you go. Oh, oh. Oh. Oh, not quite. Oh, I suck. Indeed. Oh, no. And we're both down. Uh, you're done, bud. Can we revive each other? No. Probably not so much, eh? I'm gonna stay behind this shield. That guy has a gold shield, though, so he can revive himself after. And we're lagging again. Oh, no. <laughs> And you're done. And I'm dead. That's it? That's all you want to play? <sighs> yeah, I'm done. <laughs> I can't blame the gear at least though, because this is awesome. Can TV we get a, awesome. a review out of 10 of Apex Legends? Apex Legends, you know what? Jury's out for me, but I am loving this setup. I, that, that wasn't out of 10. This is pretty sick. I'm loving it. Yeah, Honestly, like, even though I we haven't actually played any games that I'm particularly good at, <laughs> like, J Broforce, I was playing a little while ago on yeah. my TV at home, okay. which does not have great input, like, makes such a big difference. Yeah, the input delay on this it's is awesome. It's, like, freaking awesome. I didn't even think about it. It's that good. Yeah. Ting is the mobile carrier that's focused on customer service and customer satisfaction. Imagine that. Imagine a phone company that when you phone them, they pick up the phone. Wow, and you don't pay extra for the privilege. You pay for only what you use, and the average Ting bill is just $23 a month per device. If you're stuck in a contract and you switch to Ting, they'll cover 25% of your cancellation fee, and they've got lower mobile data rates than ever, just $10 a gig beyond the second gig. To find out if you'll save money on Ting, just head over to linus.ting.com and try out their savings calculator. You enter your last couple of bills and how much you paid, and it'll show you how much you'll save on Ting. We actually used their voicemail to text service, by the way, and published our number, 1-833-565-LTTVM, to hear some messages from our viewers. I unfortunately don't have access to Ting here in the UK, uh, but I would love to get it. It would save me roughly around about 10 pounds if you were to convert it. So I really hope they're able to come over here into the UK. So lower your phone bill today at linus.ting.com and get $25 in Ting credit or towards a new phone in the Ting shop. So thanks for watching guys. If you just like this video, you can hit that button. But if you liked it, hit like, get subscribed, or maybe consider checking out where to buy the stuff we featured at the link in the video description. Also down there is our merch store, which has cool shirts like this one, and our community forum, which you should totally join. Uh.